Hey guys, Ari here at Bootcamp. Here are a couple updates for you. Uh, first, I'm really excited about this one. It's something that's going to help improve your organic chemistry scores. It's called the Reaction Cubing. Uh, it's over 200 organic chemistry questions with video explanations. So, a little backstory. Um, I sent out a survey a while ago asking students which section they're most concerned about on their DAT. And the biggest one was organic chemistry. And the trick to organic chemistry is what half the trick is that you simply have to know the reactions. You have to know if I take this and that, what do you get? What's the reaction? So, if you go to the organic chemistry page, you click over here on this new tab, Reaction Cubing. You scroll down, you click this button right here. It says Bootcamp OC Reaction Sheet. It's going to open up this link. Uh, this is a 28 page document with every reaction you need to know for the DAT. It's all located in one place. I highly recommend printing it out, studying this, uh, living it, reading it. It's really like memorizing everything that's on this document for the organic chemistry section. And then here's the special part once you're done studying a section, like you're done studying alkene reactions and alkyne reactions, you can come back here to the Reaction Cube Bank and you scroll down. And our team member Tyler created an entire question bank for you based in that sheet. So you click on this, okay, and okay, reactions, and it's going to bring you over here to the question bank. You hit start review. Um, you know, you should be able to answer this based on what you learned from the sheet, what you learned from Mike's videos. You hit check. Every one of them has a video explanation that's short, sweet, uh, concise to the point. Uh, check it out. Let us know if you like it. I think it's going to really help improve your organic chemistry scores. Next, I want Bootcamp to be perfect for you guys. So a week ago, somebody posted that they were trying to like cross off an answer choice by right clicking it but accidentally they hit the back button that pops up from that menu and they lost their entire test, and that just like really sucks. Um, so check out this new feature. Now, when you try to do that, you should say like you go up here, biology test two, you're crossing off advanced choice, but then you right click and like the back button is like right there, it's like one pixel over. If you accidentally press it, you get a pop-up confirmation that says, are you sure you wanna leave the page? Just say no, now your test is never gonna get lost. Uh, even if you try to swipe backwards, right? You accidentally swipe with two fingers if you're on a map, uh, you get this pop-up confirmation to stay on page. Even if your cat walks across your keyboard and hits the uh, the close button, you get this pop-up confirmation. So you know we're always listening to your voice. We're always listening to your feedback. And if you ever experience any other frustrations, like please let us know. Like we're always listening. That's all for now. Uh, keep it studying. Check out the organic chemistry reaction bank. Uh, let us know if you like it. And I'll catch you guys next week. See ya.